suppose it shall be my turn before long, probably. Oh yes, you're the guy with those uh, fish lips. Uh, so... Let's go in the church. Anything going on in here? There's a few people praying. Yeah. We did. So Marcello's not here, is he? No. Dun, 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 dun. I wonder if he's... Hmm. I honestly can't remember where I need to go next. Let's uh, let's chat to the party, actually. Let's see what they have to say. Of course, I could go see Medea again, because quite a bit of plot stuff's happened since we last spoke. I can feel the tears welling up. Just reminds me how we couldn't do nothing to help. Well, again, we we just... We, we were useless. We really were. Can't be sure, but call it a hunch. Anyway, he isn't here. Nowhere near here. He's somewhere far, far away. How do you know? Alright, well, I'm guessing he might be at Neos. Possibly. So, we're gonna head there. Ceremony? Oh, I wonder if he's going to be like, uh, I don't know, properly inducted or induced as the uh, as the new high Lord High Priest, maybe. Ah, and daytime. Uh, now I wonder if Medea is going to join us in our sleep again. I'm just. <laughs> You know what I mean. Uh, I'm just going to stay at the end quickly. I know we don't need to heal, but I'm going to. Just out of curiosity, if she's going to say something. There she is. I'm so glad you're safe. When you were captured, I didn't know what I was going to do. Father and I decided to continue the journey by ourselves. <laughs> but, you know... <laughs> he couldn't stop talking about you. He really depends on you. Of course, I do too. I should hope so. Oh, if only Prince Charles were more like you. I know. But hey, life's, uh, life sucks. <laughs> and she fades. So yeah, I really should go visit her at the spring, but... I don't know if I can be bothered. So we're gonna have to try and find out what the ceremony's all about. See if we can't uh, maybe stop it. I don't know. We need to get that scepter back. We need to destroy it or do something with it. Um, but, um, so we're just gonna just gonna go this way, maybe. I don't know really where we're supposed to find Marcello now. I think we found the ceremony. Ladies and gentlemen, as you are all aware, the Lord High Priest has passed away. Our prayers go with him. Now he sits beside the goddess. There are those intent 
on making spurious allegations about the circumstances surrounding his passing. But I can assure you, he died a natural death. Caused by a scepter. And I tell you this, I have no intention of becoming the next Lord High Priest. Dun dun dun, well that's a bit of a plot twist. Or rather, I have no intention of becoming another hollow idol, like all those we have had to endure until now. I'm sensing he's going to want to be something worse. <laughs> I ask you, what is a king? You don't want to be a king. A king is but a man born into the right family. Should that give him the right to do whatever he pleases? Be waited on hand and foot and answer to no man? A soldier demanding such treatment would never be tolerated. Damn, he's getting into the speech, isn't he? Even if such a soldier had the stature of a king, he would never be allowed to escape the social class into which he was born. I am such a soldier, born out of wedlock and thrown out of my own home. A commoner like me has no right to be Lord High Priest. That is the belief of the church. Yes, such positions of weighty responsibility should be filled exclusively by incompetent aristocrats. Oh, he's having a dig at everyone. He smashed Our a candle. Great, noble and righteous holiness. Whatever did he achieve? A sorrowful prayer for our uncertain world? Perhaps. But certainly nothing more. The Lord High Priest, our kings, our goddess, all of them reign over us from their high, exalted thrones. Each one as useless as the next. Marcello's really ripping into uh, basically everyone above him. I can understand but that. I am different. Oh, really? For I have not one drop of nobility in my veins. And some very awesome sideburns. I, I got to give you that. Yet I am here, and only as a result of nothing but my own merit. Very inspirational. Hmm. Still a dick, though. You wanted us to die in that prison. Follow me. It is time to oust our artless rulers. It is time to choose a new leader. Oh, they're not allowed to leave. Well, this makes things fair. So. You have a choice. Follow me. Or die? Or meet your fate, just as those intruders shall. To be fair, we didn't really make much of an effort to blend into the crowd. We stood smack bang in view of everyone. What did we expect was going to happen? Alright, now we run. Oh, okay. We can take these guys. Ooh, what's going on there? What? Oh, the gold... Ah, the gold, gold bird. Gold bird's soul speaks to mage. I forgot about that kid's creepy voice. You could have actually come in handy a lot sooner, you know. Yeah, what do you think about that? Should have stayed away. Oh, you're possessed. But if you stand between me and my destiny... You're definitely possessed. You leave me no 
choice. Yep, possessed. And then the boss fight, which I'm not really prepared for at all. Crap. Uh, don't know this guy's abilities. In fact, I'm going to just check what his abilities are. Okay, so I've read up a little bit about him. He uses Wave of Ice, so we're just going to have to be quite lucky with our tension. I mean, the Timbrel thing we have now is going to help, so I'm going to try and make use of that. I'm going to cast some um spells if I can. And uh, that's about it. Let's see how this goes. I'm going to try and increase our defense somewhat. I think we're just going to try and go for 20 tension attacks. Gives us a bit of chance there, maybe, hopefully, to uh, actually hit him. But a very cool arena for this boss fight. Right in front of the goddess statue. And he's got just over 3,000 HP. So those wind sickles. Fairly nasty ability. And he, yes, he attacks twice. So. Let's, uh... Let's get some... He's actually... He can use Helm Splitters to reduce his defense. So I'm going to do that. Jessica's going to try... Uh, casting Umph on... Yangus. And Angelo... is just going to multi-heal... Too bad. Oh, very nice. And that was perfectly timed, actually. Our defense has been reduced again, but... Ooh, Kafrizzle. Yeah. Angelo. Okay, not too bad. We can deal with that. Rinse and repeat. Rinse and repeat. In fact, yeah, another kabuff. All right, physical attacks. And wind sickles, fine. Uh, T thrust, just same again. Uh, yeah, helm splitter again. Why not? I'm actually going to have Jessica cast the well, use the timbrel again. Hopefully, she'll do it quicker than uh, the enemy. And Angelo just heal. Alright, 50. Can Yangus and Mage get an attack off quickly? That would be marvellous. Oh yes, alright. Mage has got one. Nice, good. Now please don't use Wave of Ice. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Yangus is going to do some very nice damage, I feel. Oh, pretty much the same again, actually. <laughs> uh, I need to uh, use... Um, I'm going to call my... Ooh, yeah, I'm going to call my monster team. I'm going to call Outer Heaven. Get the golems on the job. And straight off the bat, transformation. Wonderful. Oh, you sod. Oh, I thought he was going to, like, dismiss it straight away then. That was an interesting ability. Oh, he can heal himself. Aren't you cute? All 
100, that's nice. Ah, good, yeah. Waste that on this guy, that's fine. Oh, and he's dead. Wow, that was easy. Level 42 for Mage. And uh, I was putting them in Courage, yes. Lionhearted Omni Heal. Ooh. Now, obviously, it's a healing ability, but what exactly it does, I can't remember. So. I don't believe it. How could you? So that's what, four? Four times, is it? Am I. Could it be more than that? I don't know. Oh! You look very familiar. I must thank you. Why? What have we done now? He has been a stubborn one, but with oh. your help, I can finally console this flesh as my own. Oh, so we weakened Marcello, and now we can control him fully. This fool has disposed of the Lord High Priest for me. The final heir is no more, and the seal of the scepter is broken. Well, shit. That's not good. Yes. The time has come for my resurrection. Now! Complete my revival. My revival to flesh and blood. Ah, it's just vandalism. Things just got a little bit crazy. Oh, wow. It's like Superman Returns, only better. <laughs> Very strong Dark Chronicle vibes from this, actually. Wow. So we really messed up, didn't we? How are we not dead? Take it, everyone can see that. Oh, it's kind of pretty, actually. It's oh, look who it is, the great Calder Asher. Oh, and there's the spring. What was that guy's name again? Can't remember. Back at the gully. I can't remember her name as well. Or was it? Oh, was it Raya? I have such a terrible memory for these side characters.
Who would live in a place like this? Yangus, as always, has the most comfortable position. Shit. Oh, look who it is! He's clinging on for dear life. Well, he sent us into a pit. Let's send him into one. Oh, he's gone. Oh, his brother saved him. What? What what are you doing? Let me go. You heard the man. If you hadn't interfered, I could have had all of Rathorn's power. But it's all over now. All hope is gone. Let me go. I don't want your help. You st oh, st we still grab him? How does that work? No. I won't let you die. Oh, hang on, guys. It's about to get emotional. You will go on living. Knowing that the brother you despised your whole life took pity on you. I won't let you have everything your own way. Uh. You're determined to disgrace me more? You! More than ten years. It was more than ten years ago that I first came to the Abbey, having lost my family. And you were the first person I spoke to. I had nothing. No family, no home. I was all alone, and I didn't know anyone at the Abbey. You were kind to me. Just for those first few moments, you were genuinely kind. As soon as you found out who I was, it changed everything. But I never forgot that moment of kindness. You will regret the day you saved my life. Oh, come on, Marcello. Can we just not let bygones be bygones? You know, I really don't care. Do your worst. You can't hurt me anymore. Good on you, Angelo. Good on you. Yeah. Bit of a victory, that is, in my book. See you, Marcello. It's going to take you a while to get anywhere with that limp. Oh. It's a bomb! No, it's a ring. Isn't this your ring? Your Templar's ring? It's yours. It means nothing to me now. Angelo, are you just going to let him leave? He's really badly hurt. Fuck him. He can struggle. He deserves it. I wonder what's going to become of him. I don't know, but that that was uh, that was quite the scene. Holy crap. Holy crap. Imagine falling down that. Just imagine for a second falling down that. Ugh. Gives me shivers. The Neo swell. It's a bit of a state now, isn't it? Oh, his hair's all messy. Uh, in fact, let's just check out that ring we just got. Ten attack. Yeah, it's not actually that great. Not really worth equipping, if I'm honest. Because that's more defense and that's kind of more useful, so... Oh well, at least we got his ring. So, uh... Yeah. Kind of feel sorry for the... 
for the residents of this place. I mean, glad they survived, but still. Kind of lost everything they have. Definitely the work of pure evil, I'm guessing. So, I suppose we should just leave. And, uh, I do believe now is the point where maybe at least one side quest has, hope has uh, opened up for us, which I will be doing in the next video. And uh, then we'll, uh, we'll be heading to find that giant floating castle in the sky, wherever it is. It's going to be around here somewhere. And I do believe that is the final dungeon of the game, so we're, we're really on the home stretch now. Well, near enough. I hope you're enjoying this. I've really enjoyed this so far. It's been, it's been awesome. And uh, I shall see you in the next video.